Good morning everyone. Last class we have seen the conversion method of hexadecimal into decimal and binary. So now we are going into another topic which is binary representation of signed numbers. So what is meant by signed numbers? Signed numbers represents computer level. Computer they can handle both positive and negative numbers. Normal number, positive value, positive value, negative value, negative value, so on. But in computer and binary representation, in my number systems, there we call it as signed and unsigned. So what is meant by unsigned number? What is meant by signed number? So positive value, you know, we pay me plus one or two total number, na, what are they going to do? For example, plus two or eight more number, na. That is a positive number, and there are two plus four are not two plus we just write two. Okay, so the two positive number now plus two positive number now. So that is called unsigned number. So there is no sign between. Uh, there is no sign before the number in the sense that is a positive number, which is also called as unsigned number. Apo signed number na ina di na opposite of unsigned. For example, minus two. So minus two. If a minus two na kung negative number na, you have to put minus before the number, right? So without that symbol, we will consider as a positive number. So my for plus na plus na mo po dalay nga, po dalay nga that is also a plus number, a positive number. So in minus value, you have to put minus in front of the particular number. So the signed number is called as negative numbers. So what is the binary representation of negative numbers? How will you calculate? How will you convert a binary value from a negative value? For a negative decimal value, the binary value can be different. Okay. So there are uh, three types of uh, different options, uh, different ways are available in computer. So there are signed magnitude representation. Once complement and two complement. So three methods are there. One is signed magnitude representation, another one is once complement, and another one is two complement. So yeah, it will be easier to follow. And once two complement, so it will be easier to follow. Okay, so the interest is there. So yeah, it will be easier to follow. And before that, the negative number, the pre number represent the number. The negative number is called as signed number. So sorry, no. So the negative numbers, binary number, the negative number, you have to convert it. That means the most significant bit. The first bit, very first introduction class, say, or a bit slag, a bit binary value, which is that leftmost bit, that is MSPU, rightmost bit, that is LSPU. So MSP in the sense least significant bit. MSP means most significant bit. Okay, that the MSP value will be sign bit. Consider as a sign bit. Okay, our parity bit. This will be a one more question. So please know this. Okay. So sign bit is the most significant bit. And what are the question number one? You must be a you must be a man after you take a job. But you have to tick the most. So yes, the most significant bit will consider as a sign bit. If it is a a bit value, the first value number one and number two, it will consider as a negative value. So first value number, first value number zero number, that is a positive value. Okay, other than that, first number that is MSP, that most uh, sorry leftmost bit. Okay, so the leftmost bit value number zero number, that will be considered as a plus number. Uh, if it is one, start from one and now one will be considered as a minus. That is signed number. Okay, so signed number that negative number one will be considered as negative. So sign magnitude representation was coming to school. So now coming into sign the magnitude method representation. Okay, the plus positive value and negative value we have to form one part. So for example, plus 43. So you have to find the binary value of 43 first. So they are already given. Uh, so I have written this. In this method, we must know about what is to be MSP and what is the sign bit. Okay, so ये तो बात है कि ना zero zero one zero one zero double one, ठीक है? So ये पे जो zero होता है ये MSP, okay? So MSP is 
zero and the stand is equal to positive number. So plus 43 will zero star and you will so this is a positive number. Okay. So minus 43 will number one number one. First value one nine four. A value is the inversion. The value is the inversion of the inversion. That will be a minus 43. That means 0 will convert into 1. 0 will be 1 and 0 will be 0. If you convert the inversion, that will be a minus 43 value. So 0 will be 1, 0, 1, 1, 0, 0, 1, 1, 0, 0, 1, 1, 0, 1, 0. If you want 1, you can 0, you can 1, you can 1, you can 1. So this is the sine bit. This is the MSB. So it will be considered as a sine bit. So this is 1 in the sense it is a negative value. If it is 0, it is a positive value. Okay. So in ignore it, 8 bits value. 8 bits are the number of If it is the form of 43 k 8 bits, 1 0 1 0 double 1. You have to add 2 more bits before that. Value, actual value you have to add two more bits. Okay, for that first step is one once complementary power. The step by step one. We have to add the value of 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 the value so, if you do 0s add the value of 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 the value uh, uh, used to, to deliver a sign. If it is plus or plus value or positive value or negative value, one of the other sign bit is not left most uh, bit, that is MSB, and the remaining seven bits are used for storing values. Okay. So the remaining seven bits we have used for storing the values. Okay. So if you look at the first bit is a sign bit. Remaining 7 bits are used to store in the values. Okay. So this is about sign magnitude. Then coming to once complement. That is going to be once complement. How to find a once complement for a sign number? Okay. For sign number, you have to uh, clear about what is going to be sign number. That is a negative number. Okay. So negative number is not to be once complement. So that is only applicable to our negative numbers. Okay. So step one in that is convert decimal to binary. For a decimal value, for example, minus one is points complement under the number. Okay. So it's minus forty three for a number of that will be going to find the points complement. If a plus forty three points complement is not we will not find the whole. Uh, not by, we won't find for uh, sorry, once complement for positive number. Okay, we cannot find. And if our plus number positive number, okay, we cannot find once complement for positive number. It is only applicable for minus number. That is in a negative number. Okay, so that is sign number. So step one is convert decimal to binary. So first and foremost, the first decimal value of the step one is you have to find you have to find the binary value of that particular decimal value. Step two is if it is eight bits, check if it is eight bits are available. Otherwise, you have to add two zero zero square you have to add and make it as eight bits values. Now you have to marry R number that I have. You have to add two more bits. Eight plus that you can add one more bit. If uh, four plus that you can add four more bits. Zero. Yeah, zero is the same. One second. Step three is last step. Invert all the bits. All bits are you zero is the same. One now one is the same. Zero is the same. You can invert. Invert only. That is the third step. Okay. So this is the just theoretical steps. Now we are going into problem. That means for problem, I am substituting the answer. So find one's complement for minus twenty four. So minus twenty four is the negative value. That so. It is applicable to find it can be find what's complement. Okay, so what's complement is the minus number of the number of the number of So, problem number of the 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 So, that means negative number of the 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 number 
So that number is first step is convert decimal to binary. So you have to find binary number of 24. So write given number 24. So 24 then you have to find the binary value. For that the division, the repeated division method is going to be find the binary number. Write the values from bottom to top. So 11, triple zero. So write that number. 
So the third step is one's complement. And I have told you after completing one's complement only, you can do the two's complement. So find out the one's complement first. For that, invert all the bits. Change 0 to 1 and half 0 to 1 to 0. So 0 is a 1 and 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 1 to the ADS B value. So this is the last value. After this, we have both the step in the third step. In the fourth, in the third step, we have to write the one right side. 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 Now, the final complement is the value of the one right side. We have to write the one right side. So, the two complement is the one right side. We have to write the one right side. Leftmost way. If you add 1A and 1A, you can add 2 products. Binary value is 1 plus 1 is 10. So, if you add binary addition, you can add 2 products. Now, if you add 1 plus 1, you can add 10 carry 1. And 0 plus 1 and 1 plus 0, 0, 0. 0, 0 is 0. 1 is 0. 1 is 0. 1 is 1. 0 is 1. So, this is the same thing. 1 plus 1 is 10, 1 plus 0 is 1, 0 plus 1 is 1, 0 plus 0 is 0. Now, if you have 10, you can add 1 value to 0 and 1 value to 0. If you have 1 value to 0, you can add 1 value to 0. Now, if you have 1 value to 0, you can add 1 value to 0. 1 plus 1 is 10, so 0 is 1 value to 0. If you have 1 plus 1, 0 and carry 1. So 1 plus 1, 0, carry 1. If you have 1 plus 0, value is 1 plus 0, value is 1. Again, carry in the way, so you can directly change the character, write the numbers. If you have 0, character, you have 0, again 1. So this is the two's complement of plus 24. One's complement is this way to change the number. Third step is to change the number. Two's complement is to change the number. You have to add one more point and one in the answer. Just add one to the LSP. This is the one's complement. One's complement is to change the number. You have to add one from the LSP and write the so this is about sign to magnitude numbers and one's complement and two's complement. Now here we have a question paper coming up. They have given a number, for example, minus 24 to put that here, and then here are the minus value of it. For example, minus 28, minus 38, and then here are the number of it. Find the two's complement or find the one's complement. Okay, it's a very easy topic. Hope you all understand this concept. Thank you.